Yo, what's up, what's up, what's up? I am Stan Jones, welcome to Doing It Films. You know what I'm saying? We uh, gonna show you everything from tutorials, uh, for music, video, stuff, my camera, but we're gonna show you a bunch of stuff, you know what I'm saying, on this channel. But anyway, today we are going to be talking about this little thing right here. Give you a quick thing, if I can take this off the thing. Hold on. I'm trying to get it unplugged, hold on. Bam! This little thing right here. It's Behringer. It's the Behringer uh, Euphoria UM2. This is a USB device, which I'm currently using. Uh, not right now connected to my camera, nothing like that. But I use it to my other system. So when I do other things and I need to do uh, like any kind of audio here or something like that, I need to put it straight through my other computer that I do all my video editing on, I can. Comes in handy, got a 40 bucks on Amazon, clean, good little DAAD converters, no problems. I run it through USB 2.0 so you don't have to be USB 3 or anything like that. Um, and then it has two front inputs and has two outputs. The only thing I don't like is the fact that the outputs are RCA. I mean, who, 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 who uses this anymore really nowadays? But the front, you have, you got your mic line over here, you got your mic line over here. You got your headphone jack, you got an instrument line right here. You got your direct monitor right here. Of course, on the back, you also got your Phantom Power 48 volt switch right there, bam. On the top, we got your mic line, it's your line coming in. It is that right there. Then you have your instrument gain, and then you have your, your output, which is right there. Uh, it sounds pretty good, it's clean, like I said. Uh, I haven't had any issues with it. I've been using it for about two months now. Um, I got it because I was running everything through a straight audio line, a straight uh, 3.5 millimeter line straight to the stereo, and that's how I would hear my sound from there. I mean, it was pretty accurate, it was decent, but I needed something that was a little bit better, and that came in to work just quite a bit better. Um, but anyway, yeah, I put the link for the Amazon, uh, where you can get it at on Amazon, down in the description down there. Um, and then, you know what I'm saying, just check it out, man. I mean, if you're looking for something cheap, inexpensive that works, you know what I'm saying, you run one mic line in, or you're just trying to run something into your computer as far as via uh, USB or something like that, it's a great solution. It works, it's cheap, you know what I'm saying? I don't see nothing wrong with it. Anyway, yo, thank you for watching. Hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications. I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.